August is an extremely hot month here in Israel. The sun beats down hard and there's high humidity in the air all day long. The kids are on summer vacation and this year we don't have any plans to escape to a cooler place. This year is different for us because of the war and also a unique family situation. Eyal's brother is sick and we want to stay close. For many years we used to spend a short family vacation in the north of Israel, but the north is just too dangerous these days. So my plan for August is to spend most of it indoors, enjoying slow days at home, homemaking and cooking for my family. I think I'm just trying to create an imaginary climate, kind of like an inner world without war and without so much pain. I plan to make progress on my knitting and crochet projects and thought to take you along with me on my slow summer days, keeping the news out as much as possible. Welcome to the Vlogus 24 series. I started my day pretty early in the kitchen this morning, fed my sourdough starter, made a new batch of kefir, and now I'm making these coconut balls. I will link the video where I show how I make them down below in the description box for you. Today is my mom's memorial day according to the Jewish calendar, and I want to get a few things done before we are out to meet the entire family next to her grave later this morning. Earlier this week, I finished crocheting the last round on my soft rose blanket. I decided to make an additional final slip stitch round, work to the back loop of each stitch around. And now it is waiting for me, ready to be blocked. There are so many projects that need my attention at the moment and I will have to sit and prioritize them, which I plan to do later today. But first I will pack these colorful cotton balls that will be sent to the UK. One of my Etsy customers reached out to check what cotton colors I still have in stock. So I came up with this assortment and luckily she liked it and it will be packed and sent to her to the UK in the next few days.
finished packing and the package is ready to be sent. And now before I go into the shower and get, to get ready and to get dressed, before we go out to meet my family um, next to my mom's grave, uh, I just want to make two balls of the ball of the yarn that I have left from my cotton sock. So I think it was yesterday morning that I grabbed the stitches on the second sock, sock and now I have a pair of shorties cotton socks ready, done, and I'm very, very happy with it. I tried it on. I will try to insert footage of them on my leg, on my feet. They are super, super soft and comfy, and I am positively sure that they will be well loved and well used. And now I um, checked and pa a pair of socks is made out of 50 grams and I still have 50 grams left on the ball. So I want to make two balls out of whatever I have left and to cast on another pair of socks, vanilla socks, just because it's very comfortable for me to have vanilla socks. You know, to have a small bag of vanilla socks that I can carry with me, take with me out and about. Not that I have so much time for, you know, I have too many projects on the go now and too many projects that need my attention. I'm planning later today, I'm planning to sit and um, complete the pattern for my, for my um, granny stripe shawl. I have a few of my weekly makers that asked if I can um, make it, you know, write it down so they can start to work on it. And a few, quite a few of you reached out to ask when it will be ready. So this is almost done. I want to complete it today and take it out of the table. Of course, I will still have to make pictures, which is a huge part of uh, completing a PDF pattern. But if any of you would like to test crochet my new um, granny stripe shawl, I will be very happy to have you on my test uh, as a tester. I will uh, leave my email down below here so you can contact me via this email. But yeah, I want to clean it out of the table and to get concentrated of other commitments that I want to get ready and I have a few patterns on the go, um, you know, getting prepared for the retreat with my yak in 2025, in June 2025. So yeah, so now I will just sit and uh, make two balls out of this yarn and then I will go to take a shower and get dressed to get ready to go out. Um, yeah, as I explained, I decided that I will try to make like make the most out of this August. We don't have any special plans and for me it's special because I really what I like the most is staying home, spend time in the kitchen, cook, you know, spend time with homemaking which is I think something one of the things that I enjoy the most and spend as much as much time as I can with my makings. I plan to take you along with me. I don't think I will be able to vlog every day, but I will vlog during August and I just took it, you know, jumped on the, we say in Hebrew, jumped on the train to of vlogust. I don't know. I think this is the way they call it here on YouTube. And I just joined the vlogust um, kind of thing. So yeah, I hope you will enjoy it.
ישראל, בעל משכבה יהיה השלום, הוא והיא וכל בנות ישראל השוכבות עימה, בכלל הרחמים והסליחות, וכן יהיה לצון ונאמר אמן. Back, back to the air condition. Thanks God. It is so hot and outside. I was mindfully wearing my long sleeve linen shirt, which I knew will protect me a little bit, but it is so hot and humid and I want to go back immediately. The first thing that I'm going to do is um, changing back to my good old uh, and not so fancy black t-shirt and you know, short tights uh, and put all my uh, clothes in, you know, in a short cycle in the laundry machine. But yeah, it was a, a good meeting, a good mem memorial uh, meeting for my mother. We have a very, very supportive family and luckily people that they are people that know how to enjoy a good laugh and have a you know, sense of humor. So it wasn't only just sad, it was also funny and we had laugh. Uh, you know, it was, it was a good meeting and I'm very happy my mom had such a lovely memorial um, ceremony today. So yeah, now I will take you to make some lunch together with the boys, my active starter. I just came inside and realized that my starty, starter is bubbly and active and I it is ready. So I can make sourdough, we will make sourdough together, we will cook lunch together. And then I want to be back here to make some progress on my projects. I really want to finish writing my um, granny stripe shawl pattern just to finish with all the writing in the PDF file and then I plan to take you along with me to a lovely sunset walk because yesterday um, I thought I will today take my camera with me or at least my phone to a lovely sunset walk and share some of the beautiful flowers that um, we have on the new path that we walk in. So we, we have a small village next to us that we both, Eyal and I, we walk there. It takes like five to ten minutes and then we, you know, from every time, from time to time we change the path that we walk through but this is a lovely one and I want to take the camera and to share some footage of the lovely flowers there with you during sunset hour, which is also lovely. So yeah, let's go prepare some lunch and sourdough, make some work, and I'll see you on a sunset walk later. <laughs> 